When doing competitive analysis on a specific category or line of business, it's crucial you're able to compare just a portion of the website. If I'm focused on laptop-related sales, analyzing Samsung.com versus HP.com at an aggregate level won't do me much good. You'll need to be able to segment the entire website to analyze just the relevant portions on an apples-to-apples -apples basis. Thankfully, the Similar Web Segment Analysis tool is here to help with this and more. Let me show you. Let's continue with the laptop example and say I want to understand the digital performance of the laptop category for six major brands, Lenovo, Dell, HP, Asus, Samsung, and Acer. Within the website segment analysis tool, we can define the rules that allow us to hone in on just the laptop related portions of each website. For example, for Asus, all of their laptop related pages can be found under the forward slash laptops folder. Segment analysis can also build complex filtering rules comprised of multiple or and and statements, so you can build your segments with precision every time. For time's sake, I went ahead and repeated this process for the other five brands. I'll then define a custom industry called laptop market so I can easily reference this group of six segments for quicker analysis. Now comes the juicy part. We can compare these segments head to head in order to get the right insights. Once we've created our custom industry, we can head to market analysis and I can immediately see that Lenovo is the market leader with 33% traffic share. Next, let's head over to segment analysis where we can look at traffic and engagement. Although Samsung is a small player here, there's a massive spike of traffic in February 2023, something worth investigating at a later date. If we had analyzed the entire website for each of these companies, we would have totally missed these laptop-related insights. Samsung looks like the clear leader here, but it's coming from a plethora of different business lines. Also, because segment analysis lets you slice and dice any site, another clever way to use it is to analyze how efficient an e-commerce site is at monetizing its traffic. For example, I can look at how many visitors walmart.com got at an aggregate level and compare that to just the visits it received from its order confirmation page, about 7% of the total. This gets even more interesting when I pull in a competitor like Costco for comparison. Only about 5% of their visitors get to the order confirmation page, much less efficient than Walmart. In summary, I hope you see how segment analysis within similar web digital research intelligence can help you find actionable insights that are specific to exactly what you care about. The truth is, these examples only scratch the surface of what's possible with such a powerful tool at your disposal. Want to see the value segment analysis can bring to your team? Book a demo today.